For this practice set, exercise 5.15 dominant. We need to write a method dominant that accepts three integers as parameters and returns true if any of the three integers is larger than the sum of the two other integers. So the integers are going to be passed in any order. The largest value could be any of the three. If no value is larger than the sum of the other two, we are going to return false. So we're only returning true if our kind of highest value is greater than our other two values. To do this, I'm going to go back to a previous problem that we have done. So I'm going to go back to has a midpoint. We could stop here, but I'm going to go back to consecutive where it first started. And the video for this, where we get this code, is linked below the like button in the description. So I'm going to copy that and paste it here. There's a few things that we need to change. First is the method name. It's going to be dominant. We're still returning a Boolean, and we take three integers as a parameter. We're going to find the minimum of the three. We're going to find the max, and we're going to find the mid. Now, we are going to need to do our comparison inside of here. So what we're basically saying is we need our minimum plus our middle to be greater, or I'm sorry, to be less than whatever our max is. And if that is the case, we can submit and pass all the tests because that means our max, if it returns true, is greater than our, minim our minimum plus our middle. And otherwise, it's going to return false. And that's how we do 5.15, which is dominant.